all the way up until I had her, I got high. And luckily, when I did have her, it, everything was fine with her. She only stayed in the hospital for five days. Then I knew, like, God had blessed me for a reason. After I had her, my youngest, which is my newborn, um, DCS came to the hospital and had told me about the VOA. And I told him I would go. And so I came here and it's helped me out a lot. The VOA is different from other rehabs that I have been in or other programs because they do let you have your children. Even if you don't have your child with you at the time, there's other children there that motivate you, you know, that motivate you to be a better mother, that, you know, motivates you to stay clean and stay sober and do what you have to do, you know, for your child. Being around other moms with their kids, it's better, it's easier to stay clean with people, like, like, and seeing them do it, it makes me want to do it more, too. They support you. I've never had so much support in my life. I've never been able to open up about my situation until I came here. I really like this place. Like, I'm really glad I came. It, I'm actually clean. I, I haven't been clean in a really long time. We do groups all morning, and it's parenting groups and groups to, like, stay clean and stuff. Having her with me at the VOA was honestly the best thing that they could have ever came up with. Like having her there, like seeing her every day while I'm going through recovery and knowing like I'm doing this for her, I have somebody that's motivating me, was I think the best thing that could, cause I don't know if I would have, could have done it without her. I want to be sober and be a better person for her and for me. It's just a very amazing place, and I don't think I would be where I'm at today if it wasn't for the BOA.